Hi guys, welcome to this Excel course. In this video, we are going to take a quick look at the flush fill command within Excel and how you can use it to quickly separate out or fill data in. So in this instance, we have a spreadsheet with an example of all American presidents. And what we want to do is we want to say separate out the first name and the last name. I'm just going to insert a couple of columns here. Now to use the flush fill, what you need to start doing is filling in some data to give the flush fill some information to work with. So we are going to the first cells, filling some basic information. Now that should probably be enough. So what we do is we select our first value and go down to the end of our list. And up here in the home tab, in the editing group, we click this little drop down and fill. And we can click and flash fill. And what it will do is it will look up, uh, really analyze your worksheet. Look up here, you got your George. Your George, I will fill in the rest of the data on this basis. And this instance is taking the first name from this column. You can do the same thing in this row name. And the flash fail. Now what you will notice is because in the first few, I have literally just taken the first name up to the first space. Where there are options which have, for example, a middle name here. So the Henry and K are missing. We can actually fix this. So if you find the first instance where this happened, pass that uh, in. We then select our column and select the flash fail. You will now find that is actually inserted those values. So if we also wanted the width full stop, what we do is we would uh, find an example of one in that format. Oh, James K with the dots. Once again, we are gonna come back and uh, select way back, selecting our whole column and selecting flush fail. You will now find that the little full stop bears. So that's for today's video. We got a look in the flash fail comments within Excel. There are a plenty of instances, but this might be useful. If you got any particular question, please do let me know. And I look forward to see you in the next video.